yeah. And everybody real left me all alone He really left me all alone Now everybody see I'm doing fine Everybody wanna Hello, reach out well, Ask me how I'm doing Ask me if I need anything Get my good with my kids yeah. high What's up, what's up collective? <laughs> I hope you guys are doing well We're having a good day today All is well you guys can look at the reading at OG Becky Tarot Dot Online. That's OG Becky Tarot Dot Online. Thank you guys for checking out my channel. Like this video, subscribe, and make sure you turn on my notifications. Also, drop a purple heart. Also, I moved it from down below because someone cashed at me and asked me how many tips until I move it off the screen because it's making the video small. Okay. <laughs> So, I have taken the subtitle off the, the screen down here, but y'all know what it is. Point proven, okay? Appreciate y'all, everybody, who did support me. Okay. Hold on. So, we got the Hermit and Three of Cups. Somebody, maybe this is in a friend group. Maybe this is a close friend. This individual wants to unalive you for some reason. I don't know if this is some sort of setup that they are involved in, some sort of betrayal. This could definitely be a setup, an armed robbery going wrong. Someone definitely needs to be careful with their friends, with their surroundings. Yeah. We got Wheel of Fortune. So somebody believe you have something? Oh, because of your value? You have valuables? Somebody could be definitely trying to, um... Like I said, rob me. Oh, rob was going wrong. But this is somebody, like, you're going to be hanging out with. This could be at a club, a late night event, a shot just heard a show. If somebody is an artist, any type of artist, this could be a, um, a poet show, rap show, singing show. This could be any sort of a show. I just heard after the show. And his friend is supposed to be with you after the show. But you, I believe you you could possibly have felt some animosity with this friend for some time now. But you don't understand the animosity. But the animosity here is jealousy and hatred. This friend does have a lot of close knit feelings about you and how they feel about your success, your upcome, your accomplishments. The things that you are achieving. Yeah. You could be being very fruitful right now. And this friend is jealous of that. This is somebody who feel like you're not looking out for them more than, than you are. They feel like you need to be looking out for them more. But me, I'm a firm believer that like everybody needs to get on their own. Don't get me wrong, I bless my partners when I'm up. And even though I hope they was appreciative of it, you know what I'm saying? So like... This is somebody you actually blessed at one point. When like you you was first coming up on your career or some shit like that. This is somebody you blessed at one point. And what you feel like you you blessed them with, they feel like it wasn't enough. This person still feel like they in bondage because they feel like they in bondage because of you. Because you can get them out. But they really in bondage because they anticipated for you to get them out of bondage. And it didn't go as planned for them. Because it honestly didn't go as planned as, as it was supposed to go for you, okay? We got Page of Swords. 
new ideas, curiosity, thirst for knowledge, new ways of communicating, restless, mental energy. Yeah. And you see this is the Hermes right here by this Eight of Swords. That's because this person is going to betray you because they feel like they're in bondage. A friend wants to get you unalive or is a part of getting you unalive. I don't know if this is a hit and your friend is a part of it for some money. Yeah. Look, and then the letters. Somebody need to be careful with a lover. Recovery for financial loss, spiritual poverty, charity, improvement. Yeah, be careful with a lover. May 6th or June 5th could be significant. Be careful with a lover because this person has a this person carries bondage. This person carries bondage. This person is very argumentative with you. In a way you get into arguments with this, the lover, this is not, that is not a healthy relationship. That is not the qualities of a healthy relationship, the way that you and this person get into arguments, you and this lover. Six of Pentacles, giving, receiving, yeah. This person is like a fucking charity case. I ain't gonna even care. This person like a, a charity case. Man. And for some while now, I've been reading some masculine energy out here. Like, their lover is involved with some sort of setup. Baby mama, ex, girlfriend, wife, ex-wife, something like that. Involved with some sort of setup. Like, this has been multiple attempts, multiple failed attempts upon you. But because it is this friend here, it's one attempt. It's one attempt. Maybe somebody even gonna go to a concert. You may attend a concert and shots may be fired. Creativity, romantic charm. Yeah, look. At this point, they're trying to get creative with doing it. These individuals trying to get creative with doing it. Shit, this might got something to do with Birdman, but let me not talk about him because I remember one time I was doing a lot about him. How he was uh, trying to set somebody up and that bitch turned off and got banned in the middle of the live. I sort of run. That old bird man, a snitch, he gonna get your shit fucked up. That old clean cook or something. His fingers were quick to report some shit. This committed real quick. Saving money, security, control, frugality. Man, I don't know if you've been saving money to get out of this relationship, this the lovers, or you've been saving money because you know this relationship is about to go left, but you're not understanding what, how it's about to go left, what the ending is. Well, what these individuals believe the ending is about to be. You really shouldn't be trusting nobody at this point because everybody involved with this shit, I feel like. You really shouldn't be trusting nobody because this price is really high. It's a higher amount than you giving to people. A higher amount than you are taking care of people. Yep, really. 
upside down two of cups. Self-love, dishonory, distrust, breakups, imbalance, tension, broken communication. Then we got the seven of wands. July 2nd could be significant to somebody. Challenge, competition, protection, preservance, defense, maintaining control. Drop a purple heart, y'all. I'm telling you, this the lover got something to do with this shit. I just heard she cool with the partner. She cool with this friend who is supposed to die with you. Supposed to be involving the her with you. But again, this is task that has failed multiple times on multiple numerous occasions. This has failed several times, okay? King of Pentacles. Wealth. Business. Look. <laughs> Leadership. Security. Discipline. Abundance. Prosperity. Generosity. Man, this person is being very generous. We're trying to get you unalive. It's a ring leader to this shit now. It's not just your friend. It's not just this three of cups. This is somebody you develop with. This ain't no new newcomer to the crew. This is somebody you have been knowing. This is somebody that been in the cut with you. And with this king of pentacles, this little friend, this little partner, this little home, home girl, homeboy, they think that this higher up, this superior person can give more. They can benefit more off of harming you than helping you because again, you could be saving money. Okay? You could be saving money. And this person is being very generous. This person is being very generous to the people around you to get you set up and shit. This person is this, this King of Pentacles is offering money up front. Like while they're on the phone with someone, they'll cash at them a thousand dollars, two hundred, three hundred dollars. To smooth them out. I just heard to smooth them out during a conversation. Yep. Upside down, King of Wands. Impulsiveness. Ruthless. High expansions. Haste. Unachievable expectations. Mm. Unachievable expectations. They're really expecting to cause an uh, ending for you, but like, they're not understanding. It's not your time to go, it's just not your time. It's just not your time. Yeah, three of swords. It's just not your time. The most that can happen is they hurt themselves trying to hurt you and come upon you. I'm going to pull a few more here. Look, like I said, look, oh, look, four staff, upside down the answers. You're dealing with an upside down ass individual, somebody who fake stable. I just heard actress tell your person to show you what they, what they have saved up. A significant situation here. Somebody could have been giving their partner something to save up. and Or their partner could have been saying that they, they don't have it right now because they've been saving their money. Or they don't have it because they're trying to save their money. They can't do this because they're trying to something like that. You need to tell them to show you what they've been saving. Okay? 
because after they do whatever was premeditated, that's why they're going around saying they've been saving. So when this shit happens and the money they receive is like not, oh, I don't know where they had money because this person, quote unquote, been saving. But this person has not been saving. This person's bank account is actually in a negative. I'm seeing in a negative. The max this person has in a savings account is $100. This person is like really fit, stable than a bitch. This person is broke as fuck, okay? This is somebody who fits stable. This is somebody who broke than a bitch, yeah. And for some time now, you know you have been with an upside down, the empress, the emperor. Like, this person ain't got no hustle, ain't got no drive, ain't got no motivation, ain't really trying to do nothing. This person could be acting like they're trying to do something, but they ain't really trying to do nothing. They really ain't on shit. This person is more looking for so to be handed something. Yeah, this person is looking to be handed to from a, a, the emperor, the empress. And we got an upside down the empress and a straightforward the emperor. Okay? The root of all evil is money. Money is the root of all evil, okay? Now let's get it now with yes and no, yes and no, Holy Spirit. Yes and no, Holy Spirit. Let's get it. Don't stop. There's something better. Yes, exclamation point. Yes, exclamation point. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure y'all like this video, subscribe to my channel, and drop a purple heart. I really appreciate all the support. Y'all stay prayed up, stay peaceful. I'm not our love.